I think uh, it's up to people to do what they can. And if everybody did what they could, the world would be a much better place in any case. But many people, I think, uh, fundamentally good people, they, they lack the courage to think they can make a difference. I think it needs a certain arrogance, secret, not visible. genocide in Cambodia. Two million Cambodians were killed or died from starvation and disease. Many were buried in mass graves. This documentary about my orphanage in Cambodia is dedicated to the children who didn't survive the killing fields. My orphans weren't born during Pol Pot's reign of terror, but they lost grandparents and family they will never know. This is my story, the story of my children, and how together we fought to save our orphanage. It's also a story about confronting memories of the past. And in a small way, it is the story of Cambodia. In 1993, when I first met the children, I had no idea how difficult it would be to build up that um, trust. Because when I first met them, and I first was, uh, I suppose, addicted to them. I feel about these children as though they are my own. It's very difficult for me to make people understand that. These are my children. They're all so hungry to call somebody mum. I think they called me mum within the first week because they don't have anybody to call mum.